Bali is an island with a myriad of natural and cultural riches which are very popular. The province of Bali is very famous for its various types of traditional dances, and one of them which is popular among domestic and even international people is the Kakak dance. The Kakak dance itself was created by Y and Limbok in 1930 from the village of Bona, Jayanimar, Bali. This dance has been popularized overseas with the help of Walter Spees, a painter from Germany. The Kakak dance is an artistic dance performed by dozens of male dancers who sit in a circle and with a certain rhythm utter kak, kak, kak and raise both arms. Generally this dance is played by 50 male dancers. The uniqueness of the origin of the name of the Kakak dance comes from the dancers who keep shouting kak, kak, kak from, there the name of the Kakak dance is formed. The Kakak dance tells the story of Ramayana and Dewe Shinta who are in the Dandaka forest, then Dewe Shinta is kidnapped by King Ravana, but at the end of the story Dewe Shinta is rescued by Hanuman. The Kakak dance is also called the fire dance because the performance is performed by sitting around a bonfire in the middle. The Kakak dance is also associated with mystical issues because besides being immune to fire, it is also believed to be possessed by a spirit which causes the dancer to lose consciousness so that he acts outside of logical reasoning during the Kakak dance. The Kakak dance can actually be seen in various tourist attractions in Bali. But the place that is very popular among foreign and domestic tourists is the Kakak dance which is staged in Uluwatu in the evening before sunset. From there, it is clear that the panoramic beauty of the sunset over the Indian Ocean from the Uluwatu cliffs is intended to be a charming and attractive background during the Kakak dance performance. There are many more popular places to watch the Kakak dance in various tourist attractions in Bali. For example at Garuda Wisnu Kinkana, Danalot and Pandawa Beach. The clothes worn by the dancers when dancing the Kakak dance are traditional Balinese clothes, the dancers will be bare-chested and wear colored and white checkered cloth, common ed, and there are ring rings worn on their ankles. As for other facilities such as offerings, makeup, and masks, In general, traditional dances are accompanied by music and gamelan, this does not apply to the kakak dance. Therefore, this dance requires extra cohesiveness and cooperation. One acts as a leader, another acts as a high and low tone stressor and another acts as a storyteller, puppeteer. The hallmark of the kakak dance is the harmonization of sound and movement performed by dozens of dancers. Of course it is not easy to harmonize sound and movement for dozens of people so that it becomes a series of dances that have magical and beautiful nuances. Initially the Kakak dance had a function as a traditional ceremony, but over time this dance has several functions as a ceremony, entertainment facility, performance facility, and educational facility. The international community also knows the Kekak dance by the name the monkey dance because one of the main characters named Hanuman is very popular and iconic. From this we can see that culturally, Bali already has high and close cultural values, they are able to maintain the Kekak dance from year to year. And now the Kekak dance is no longer something that is only a spectacle during ceremonies but has become entertainment for foreign and domestic tourists visiting Bali.